Thing. Order! Order! You are an incorrigible delinquent at times. <laughs> Behave yourself, man! Now, Views Night, our regular chance to voice often difficult and to some unpalatable thoughts. Tonight, the Israeli historian and author of Sapiens, A Brief History of Humankind, Yuval Noah Harari, argues that fear mongers are more dangerous than terrorists. Fear mongers are more dangerous than terrorists. Since 2000, terrorists have killed fewer than 100 people in the UK. During the same period, obesity-related diseases killed about half a million Brits. So why do we fear terrorists more than we fear fried bacon? Terrorism is theater. Terrorists stage a frightening spectacle of violence that captures our imagination and turns it against us. Terrorists kill a handful of people and cause millions to fear for their lives. In order to calm these fears, governments react with a show of security, orchestrating immense displays of force, such as the persecution of entire populations or the invasion of foreign countries. Usually, it is this overreaction to terrorism that threatens the peace of the world more than the terrorists themselves. Terrorists are like a fly that tries to destroy a china shop. That fly is so weak it cannot move even a single teacup. So the fly finds a bull, gets inside its ear, and starts buzzing. The bull goes wild with anger and fear and destroys the china shop for the fly. This is what happened in the Middle East after 9-11. Islamic fundamentalists incited the United States to destroy the Middle Eastern china shop. Now they flourish in the wreckage. And there is no lack of short-tempered bulls in the world. The success or failure of terrorism really depends on us. If we allow the terrorists to capture our imagination and then react to our own fears, terrorism will succeed. If we free our imagination from the terrorists and react in a balanced and cool way, terrorism will fail.